Let's use the spiny senses here. Oh my goodness. Oh, uh, you know what? I need her. I need to just watch her go through this jewelry. Oh, what did you find? Oh my gosh. So oh, my oh, look at these. It's time for me to check my attitude at the door. I've been a reseller for nearly 40 years, and I can't imagine my life without thrifting. I've learned about a lot of things over the years, and I love to share my knowledge and adventures with you. So let's go be profitable and make it fun. Okay, it's travel day. I'm waiting for my Uber. $54 to get to the airport. Holy smokers. But I don't want to park my car there for a week. It's a Kia. They get stolen. So, Uber it is. Doggy. I'm actually quite terrified of flying, but I learned long ago that in order to have and do some of the things I wanted to do, I had to overcome this scary thing. And so I sit on the plane and realize that I can either have faith or I can have fear, but I can't have them both at the same time. It doesn't work. So I just really concentrate on the faith part. And this trip was totally worth it. I got to connect with people I haven't seen for a very long time. I reconnected with old friends and I made some new friends. And most of all, I got to spend time with my best friend who is Dawn of Hudson Vintage and her and I are business partners in the Knit Shopping Network. And so we got to do some planning and just spend some time shopping and really connect as friends. So it was totally worth it to get over that fear. And oh yeah, look at the view. 12th floor overlooking SeaWorld of Orlando. It was a really, really glorious time. But on to the thrifting. It's thrift with, with me in Florida today, today and, and I'm not and alone. Not alone. <laughs> We're not in Kansas anymore, Toto. We're in Florida. Am I melting? Because <laughs> I feel like I'm melting. Uh, and I'm not alone. I am with Dawn of Hudson Vintage and we're going treasure hunting. And the first place we found to go literally is called the Treasure Hunt Thrift Store. I think we're in Okay, how do you say, is it Kissimmee? Kissimmee. Kissimmee? Kissimmee. Kissimmee. How do you say I it? I hardly know you. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I've never known how to say that out loud. I've Kissimmee. always read it in my head. Kissimmee, that's it. Kissimmee? Yeah. Because yeah. I've heard people say Kissimmee. Oh, you guys tell us in the comments. <laughs> is it Kissimmee or is it Kissimmee? How do you say it? Let us know. Anyway, we're going to get inside here. We're going to find some treasure. We're going to get shop done. There we go. Okay, what do we got on sale? We've got, ooh, a dollar a piece for clothes. 50% off handbags and totes. Shoes, a dollar a pair. My goodness, all right. Let's go. We're going in. Okay, what what ride at Disneyland is that from? Hello, we're here to treasure hunt. Are we in the right place? All right. <gasps> There's gonna be lots of Disney stuff, I bet, around oh, here yeah. because I love that. Look at it. It's Disneyland, not Disney World. Wow. And it's $5. I can get that in my suitcase. I love Definitely. that. It's blue. Oh my God. Hey, hold on. Hold on. Okay. I have to set this down. I forget what his name is. He's got a name. He's a, he's a, he's a thing. He's so, oh, he's Disney. Oh, he's so cute. Okay. I can't go crazy. Who is it? The orange bird. The orange bird. How creative. Right? <laughs> oh wait, I want to look at this too. I want to look at everything. Everything's catching my eye. I love it all. I'm having fun. I can't bring it all home though, so I have to be selective, but I really do. I really do love the mug, so. Ooh, I found jewelry and Dawn walked the other way. So let me find something I think uh, she would approve of. Let's see. 
Let's use the spiny senses here. Oh my goodness. Uh, you know what? I need her. I need to just watch her go through this jewelry. Because uh, nothing's like grabbing me like right off the bat. But I'm sure there's going to be something here. Oh, look how cute he is. And the prices are definitely good here. Very good here. I think they support uh, children. Some kind of a children uh, charity. Okay, I don't... I don't really... Oh, those are kind of... Let's see. Let's see if Dawn spots those. Let's see. Okay, I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go lead her back over this way. Oh, she found the good stuff. She found the actual jewelry case, because that's what she does. <laughs> Look at this. Oh! That is pretty cute. It's cute. like what came first. The chicken or the egg. I don't know if that's supposed to move. I don't know. I it kind of looks like there's some glue. Yeah. He's awful cute. Um, is he silver? I don't think so. Uh -huh. Let's see. Oh she God. found it. <laughs> okay, you have to go watch her video to find out what she says about all this because we'll come back after. Okay, so I found a couple things over there. I got this, I think it's supposed to be a pendant. I guess it could be like a keychain too. I'm not sure. It's Mickey Mouse and kind of a brutalist kind of a thing here for five bucks. I'm going to grab that. And this cloisonne clamper bracelet, see, like so, for $6. I'm going to grab that too. This is their baggy wall here. Oh my goodness. What do we got here? Just stuff. Don't need any of that stuff. Ooh, I found the stuff. Now, because I have to only get stuff that fits in my suitcase, I am really, really particular about what I grab. And I know, I could ship stuff home. I can do that, but I prefer not to. Because uh, that adds cost. That adds cost of goods. Look at these. Look at these swans. It's the set of two for $30. Like, if I was home, I might be tempted by those. I'd have to look them up. Let me look at the bottom. Let's see. Who makes you? Oh, it's heavy. It's... Okay, it looks like it might have had a sticker. It's kind of a 90s construction. They are pretty. I could see those up on a mantle. I would have to, like, take those flowers out, those dated arrangements and do something else but those are those are really nice glassy baby glassy baby present yourself glassy baby i know you're here somewhere i know you're here somewhere okay not on that shelf got a little turtle from aruba i don't need a turtle from aruba <laughs> Some Santa Claus up there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Cute little face on uh, that little one there. Let's see. Oh, oh, what are you? Little, little robin's nest little things. I know, I look at the goofiest stuff sometimes. Marjolaine Baskin for Hallmark. But what are they? Are they magnets? I think they're magnets. You know I'm enamored. I must. <laughs> Noah was asking for a rolling pin the other day because I bought him pizza dough as the first step towards making homemade pizza. I know, I'll get the ingredients to actually make the dough maybe next time, but you know, I bought, I bought the pre-made dough. So all he had to do was like spread it but we didn't have a rolling pin so I think about getting that for a joke here here you go Noah you can have a you can have a rolling pin can't wait to see what message he pops up <laughs> when he gets to that part when editing all right these actually stack see how that goes little apothecary jars they look vintage but they've priced them separate yeah three, three, and five. That makes it a little undoable. But that was cute. I I like that. I like that a lot. Then we've got little 
mortal mortar and pestle wood ones there we've got oh these are old who makes you it says stainless steel I don't know who the maker is probably like an anchor hawking or some sort oh that's interesting those look like they could be fiesta but they're not they're young's 1998 that's kind of a cool set i like it Solterra tin that's old all right let's keep looking down there okay i forgot how humid florida is <clears throat> i'm melting i'm melting there's little fans all over in here. I'm going to have to situate in front of one for a moment just to cool off. Okay, back to the stuff. Danny, which way are you going? I'm back here. Which way are you moving? I'm moving toward that way. <laughs> she can't see me. She can only hear me. <laughs> so that meant probably absolutely nothing. Oh, Look. Oh, what? Oh, what did you find? Oh my gosh. It's beautiful. No. Look at the people. Oh. Look at the people. No. It's so big. It will take up half of I my know. suitcase. Wow. He's pretty cool. Is he signed on the bottom? I didn't look. We didn't look yet. Okay. Stand by. Okay. Here's the. Oh, I hate when they do that. I hate when we they do that. Get it off. I know, but I hate when they do that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if you own a thrift store, don't do that. <laughs> um, that sign, but you can see the age. You can see the age by the wear on the bottom. He's pretty spectacular. Tapfish. Hmm. It's the new squirrel. <laughs> the lid is really heavy. They're like, they're like... I wonder, I wonder if they're like dancing or I mean I wonder what its origin is. South American or Asian? Can't quite tell. He's pretty amazing. Oh gosh, that's a tough one. That's a tough one. I don't know. Precious moments. Somebody just told me that uh, Sam Butcher just died. The uh, founder this is the of Precious Moments. Oh, it's Flintstones. Flintstones. Meet the Flintstones. Look. I like the McDonald's. light. Hey, wait, wait, wait. The lighting, like, is so good. It makes even a Flintstones mug look spectacular. Wow. Oh, that's... Oh, no, it's an upside-down wine glass. It's one of those wine glasses that holds, like, a whole bottle. That's funny. That is Polish glass with this little signature bubble on the bottom. Let's see over here. <laughs> see glassware like I'm so like I I don't know I don't even think there's anything that could make me buy glassware right now I mean there's really cute stuff here it's so it's so fun it's such it's so different than what I'm used to seeing that's the fun part about being out of town oh, I found another little shelf with some vintagey oh these are good oh they know it's good so they've got 25 on it that is an Amy Lacombe those do really really well and had that been under $15, I would have picked it up for sure. Oh, look how cute those are, but they've got broken pieces. Little owls. Okay, I gotta set my treasures down so I can see what the price is on the little owl shakers that have their original stickers. Uh, S-H-I-N, I feel like that's what I see. Six dollars for those might not be bad. Are they? They can't be each. Surely that's for the set. They're really nicely done. Super vintage. And then there was a rhino. He's oh, he's broken. It's five dollars. Ironwood. That's a pretty common piece of ironwood. This guy is ebony wood. So this, oh, this is good. So I don't know if you guys can see the difference in the color. Ironwood out of Mexico, ebony wood, or they often call it ironwood out of Africa. 
but the color and variation of the wood is different. It's the same hardness of wood, but that's really cool that I found two pieces together. Um, this guy is actually quite nice. Let's see how much you are. You are $8.75. You might be worth it. You might be worth it, little buddy, and you'd be easy to get into the suitcase. I think I will grab you. Oh, it is, oh, it's CS Prussia. I have not heard of CS. Is it CS? Am I seeing that right? So Alder would have been who painted it, but the blank or the, when it was plain white, that's from the CS Prussia company. And then someone named Alder hand painted that. It's $10. It's actually a really nice, really nice little piece, but it's the first stop. Super breakable. I can find these at home. I'm, I'm going to leave it. I'm going to leave it. <gasps> Look at that. Oh, I can see chips on it though. That's too bad. But it's like a Majolica. Let's see. Who makes you? Right, Gift ideas. Painted by hand, now creation $12. Ugh, to uh, that's me. lovely. I love it. I, I love it, but chippies. All right, there's a little shelf of goodies. That's one of those Doug Harris grannies. Fun. Some Coke classic. Little hand painted ashtrays. Just not much of a call for those. Oh, that's an interesting squirrel. It's wood. I think it's Scirocco wood. It's kind of fun. All right. I don't need to be picking that up right now. The glasses under here are pretty. They want $50 for the set. I'll just show them. Frosted with a little silver band. Those are nice. Okay. I think we are going to head out of here and find someplace air conditioned. I think we're going to look for maybe an antique mall. That might, we're going to hit so many places on this trip. So make sure you are subscribed and hit the little bell notification. So you know when the next video comes out and it'll help me get to my major milestone of a thousand subscribers. I, it will just make my day when I hit that. It's been 16 years in the making to get there. So I appreciate your help helping me get there so much. Okay, uh, we're gonna go find some air conditioning. Okay, we're doing something a little, like we just saw this and we're like, yeah, let's go check it out. It's a pawn and jewelry shop and I am with a jewelry expert. So where is she, where is she? Where is she? There she is. Okay, that was a bust. So now we are at the A to Z thrift. Oh, there's lots of things. Lots of things here. Oh my gosh, look at all the hats. Oh my. Hmm, little sensory overload right in the door. Let's look. Two for three dollars. Okay. It's kind of fun. Not quite what I'm looking for. Oh, look at this poor little donkey on the cart. Oh my goodness. That's pretty sweet. All right, we're looking for a hidden treasure. Something that I don't normally find at home would be something that I'll do much better buying it here. These are good. I find these at home though, but these are good. These controlled bubble paperweights. I usually pick those up when I see them, but I'm not going to pick that up because even though it would go in my suitcase, that's going to add like three pounds and I have a 50 pound weight limit. Jewelry, jewelry, jewelry. All pretty costumey. This matches the thing that I saw at the other store. And they have quite the uh, shoe wall and clothing. I'm not, I'm really, just really not in the mood to look for clothing. Oh, is that, oh, it's a bathing suit bottom. I thought it was just a little scarfy thing. 
Oh, there's another room? Okay. There's a whole nother room we haven't seen. It's very vintage looking. Oh, who makes this one? Oh, wow, that is so polyester. Who makes you? It's thick, it's so thick. Five dollars each. I just, I am not in the mood to shop for clothes. I think it's because I'm so hot and sweaty. Oh, oh it looks, accessory. yeah, it's clothes. See, oh, I don't know about you, but I'm, hit with the, what, I'm the, the, the so, dark. I'm so not in the mood for clothes shopping. This is actually nice. This is oh wait, needle. oh, and then there's another little closety thing here. Nope, 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 nope. Found another little hidden room with things. So, like oh, look at these. How much are they? Five, they're six dollars a set. Gosh, those are cute though. Are they six dollars cute? I like that they don't have a name of any place on them, so I think I will pick those up. Little alligators are cute. I mean, there are some salt and pepper shakers that can be worth a pretty penny. Oh, look at these frogs. All right, nothing, nothing mind-boggling exciting. I must say, oh, this pottery is pretty. Let me look at these. Let me set my mushrooms down and look at this. It's, okay, it's not as it's not as nice close up as it was from far away. MCO Industries, blah 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 blah. All right. I think I think the humidity and the heat are making me grumpy. <laughs> uh, I'm just saying. It's time for me to check my attitude at the door. Okay, we were literally gonna find some place with air conditioning. Uh, we haven't done that yet. <laughs> Let me just say, here's our mode of air conditioning right now. That's it, that's it right there. We found an antique mall. I'm just, I'm trying to get out of the car. Um, I parallel parked and I'm pretty proud of that, but whoo, trying to, okay. Oh, what, what's it telling me? I don't even know what it's telling me right now. What are you telling me? I don't know. I don't know car what you're telling me. The car is beeping at me. Why is the car beeping at me? I don't know. So we found this place, Lanyards Downtown Marketplace, and I think we're still in Kissimmee. Kiss no way, it said it was open. It said it was open till six. <gasps> no. Well, they closed at five, and it's just after five. I swear the website's at six. So now, wait, what is, what is Casa del Artisan? That looks kind of interesting, maybe. We can get into air conditioning and look. Okay, they're open. It's like they have little artisan, artisan pretties. This has some potential to find some fun things. I think Dawn's disappointed though, because it's not vintage. No, 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 I, I love this one. I, I love handmade. There are some pretties. Oh, look at the little wrapped rings. So the place we were at um, closed and and I, I, I put so much effort into parallel parking. <laughs> I'm like, okay, here, let's go in this place. It looks like they might uh, rent spaces to different, different crafters because they see quite a variety of things. That's kind of cool. Look at this whole little loop-de-loo thing here. 45 for the set? Is it, does that go together? Yeah, it's a set, 45 for the set. That's, oh, does it come with the, oh, is it the whole set? Like the earrings and the ring and the necklace and the bracelet? I can't wait to see what Dawn says about that. Super cute, look at him. He's $18.99. Just fun little pieces too. Sea glass. There's a lot of things made with sea glass here. Look how beautiful that is. I feel like we need a candle for our hotel room because it's a little musty smelling in our room. I'm, I'm like looking at these candles going, hmm. Hmm, I can't do candles at home, so why not do it while I'm away? Some really interesting things like this is 
a clay artist. We've got the three wise guys. Yes. And then we got little beach houses. And then we got little tile. Oh, that's interesting. <gasps> Look at a little guitar. Yes, I love looking at the talent of others because I don't have this talent and I admire it ever so much. Have you ever just been having so much fun that you forget what you're supposed to be doing? Like filming? <laughs> so I'm sorry that this cut off so abruptly, but um, after our little shopping, we decided to have some fun. Of course, we had great food in Orlando and uh, we went to the wax museum. There was no way we're, we were going to go to like SeaWorld or Disney World, but uh, those were fun little things we could do. And we found this nice little place that had all this stuff. We went to the Blake Shelton restaurant called Reds, I think it was. Anyway, we had a fantastic time. Don't worry, there's plenty more thrifting coming up, so be sure you've hit that subscribe button. And I will be back for the next one. You go be profitable and make it fun.